Hi everybody, this is Judy at Judy in the Kitchen. Today we're talking about green peas, also known as English peas or sweet peas. We're discussing how to freeze them when you get them home. Well, the first thing you want to do is give them a quick rinse because those pods may have some loose soil or debris on them. And then you want to remove the peas from their pods. The pods are not edible, so you really do need to remove the peas from them. If you've never dealt with them before, we're going to pretend that this is a pea pod here. And you want to snap off both ends and there is going to be a string attached on a little seam on the side and so you can snap it off and this snap off the end and the string is usually attached and you just pull it gently and that will bring you down to the other end if you haven't already snapped that then you can snap that off at that point if the string is not there or it breaks off at that first point where you try to break it off you can take a knife and just gently split the pod where that seam is but be careful not to cut in too much or you're going to cut the peas and then just gently open it up and allow the peas to come out and you'll have to do that with each and every pod then once you get them provided that the pod was not open in any way you shouldn't need to rinse off those peas because they were sealed inside of that pot you'll need to bring a pot of water to boil and then once it comes to a boil drop your peas into there and set your timer it'll either be for a minute and a half to two and a half minutes anywhere in there then drain them and then put them immediately in an ice water bath a big bowl filled with ice cubes and water and allow them to sit in there and chill for again a minute and a half to two and a half minutes once that time is up drain them really well and uh, then you can spread them out on a tray blot them dry very carefully with paper towel and then the best way to do it to keep them from becoming one big clump in the freezer is to take that tray and put it in the freezer for an hour or two until the peas are frozen take the tray out and transfer them into a freezer bag or freezer containers and label it with today's date and then return them to the freezer and make sure that you use them within one year and it is important to do this as soon as you possibly can because they are very perishable and the longer you wait to freeze them or cook them the less sweet they're going to be over time their sugars their natural sugars will turn to starch as they sit so they won't be as sweet if you let them sit and wait for a few days before you deal with them it's just like sweet corn when you pick sweet corn let me know if you have any questions or comments. This is Judy at Judy in the Kitchen. Bye for now.